Welcome back everybody, some more everybody's golf on PlayStation 4. We're going to play the new DLC course Pine Hills. Uh, we're going to go for regular tees and teeny cups. Uh, and if you think I'm doing this with standard clubs, then you need to get your head red. I'm doing this with the big old custom clubs. Because this is going to be tough. Uh, if you've not seen Pine Hills before, it's the latest of the DLC courses. Um, it's pretty hard, as you can see. Super narrow fairways. Lots of bunkers along the way, and wait till you see the greens. So, let's get this road on the show. Uphill, bit of crosswind. We're going to use the backspin just to try and get a bit more distance, perversely, because it will give me a higher shot, so I should land further up the hill. Is the theory? Is the theory? You broke the record. So there we go, 90 yards to go. Still a fair way uphill. See what I did there. Uh, a little bit of crosswind. It's going to be our approach wedge in. So I'm going to use a little bit of, um, of hook in this case. Oh, I've got a bit left, I think. Is it just going to creep on? It's just on the fringe. Ah, uh, chip time. So I've been powering up my other chipping club. So eight times the last next one to, to chip. I mean, with a teeny... It's just ridiculously hard to do. But we'll give it a go. Get in. There you go. It's so hard to make chips with teeny cups. You've got no margin. Well, there we go. And we maxed out our eight iron. So that's a good start. We're just going to have to get much closer to the pin. We can't be chipping. It's not the teeny clubs. So, par four. It's downhill. Again, a little bit of wind. Just look where you're going to land. That bunk is just waiting to swallow you up. Um, so I'm tempted to just go for it. You could back off a bit. Play for here. With the three wood. Might do that because I don't think length's going to be a massive issue on this hole. Good. A lot of left hand sway. I might have gone off the left hand edge. Pavernet left hand bunker. Are we going to get lucky or are we all going to get lucky? The RNG at times is just nuts. Okay, 140 to go. Not much wind. A little bit downhill. 9-9 nine, nine into the pin. Should be able to get this close. Got the ultra back spin. So we might have pitched it a little bit too Good. far. No, that's probably alright. I'll come back. Line was a bit off, but the pace was absolutely spot on. Looks like you made it. So we got a seven footer. Go on, get that birdie. Uh, you see what I mean about the greens? Even seven foot away with teeny cups, up. this is a challenging shot. Breaks to the left. So there's no margin for error on the read. Yeah, get in there. Pace was enough to let it just drop. So two birdies to start. Easy. Hole three. It's a par three. I mean, imagine this with championship tees and teeny cups. I mean, you've got the length to contend with. So, a little bit downhill. It's slightly downwind, but not much. But we're, we haven't got much room to play with, really. So, we're definitely going to want to overhit it and bring it back. Oh, I missed the ultra backspin. Good. A lot of left-hand sway as well on it. Where are we going to end up? Yeah, it's just going to knock us off the edge. Oh, the RNG. That's probably going for backspin. So again, let's try another chip. We're on the 7 iron now. I just want to get this close if I can. Not overly concerned with getting in the hole. I mean, if it goes in, obviously that's nice, but we've got it to 3 foot. See, this is a tricky putt. It's probably outside left edge. Yeah. Came back about half a cup. Good enough. So it's our first par. Hole four. It's a par four. And this one sort of gently curves. And I think it's not, not what you call a dog leg, but the curves just at the point where your your custom clubs are gonna get you. So we're gonna have to put a bit of a shape on this one, I think. Try and Give ourselves a good line in. You go. Don't nice want to clip shot. that trick and avoid it. Just avoided it. Oh, we got lucky there. I think we just hit the top of the bunker. 
just the top lip of it. New record. But I'll take it. So, hundreds to go. Long way uphill. A little bit of wind. Hmm. A lot of left hand nice sway, shot. so we'll miss left, I think. No, we didn't in the end. Am I going to stay on? Looks like made it. Well, you can see the gradient on this green already just from that. So, double breaker. Get a break right and left. I think it's probably right edge. Um, it's definitely more than 15 foot of pace. It's probably about there. Get in. Makes a there you go. Birdie pop. Nice and easy. Nice that gets us to three under. A ten foot is not bad on these All greens. Right. It's a par five. Now this one does kink right. There's almost two fairway lines. There's that, and then there's this line. If you can get at it. I have to go for the ultra spin. Got it. Go, go, go. Excellent. And a bit of luck clears the trees, finds a nice bit of fairway. Oh, it's just going to end up in the rough. Perversely got too much on it. Or didn't read the wind. But then if I've gone any further left, that other bunker comes in. Ah, never mind. So, uphill. Bit of, we're a little bit downwind. Oh, hit the tree. Not what we were trying to do. Look at the right hand sway on that though. That was the RNG got me there. I should have cleared that tree, but um, the sway took me. Oh, I love this game at times. By which I mean, not all the time. Great shot. That's going to be on. There we go. Looks like you made it. Go on, get that birdie. So, we would have had an eagle pup, instead we've got a birdie pup. It's down. So the break kind of fades, but we've got to hit it gently. So let's go for about there. See how we do. In the bag. Oh, that's a great pup. That's an absolute belter. It's a four under. We've made some good putts. Hole six. It's a par four. It's a six again. Long, we're going to go round the corner a bit. So let's not make the same mistake. Well, I'm just trying not to make the same mistake. Missed the ultra spin this time. So the question is, are we going to clear those two bunkers? We are. And we might just creep on. We might just come back off. No, we just made the fairway. Okay. So 135 to go. Again, it's a long way uphill. A little bit of wind. It's a 9-iron into the pin. I might just go up a club. I might just go to the 8-iron. Just because I want a little bit more. Got the ultra spin. Just a grip. That needs to come back. Ah, just too far. So again, another chip. Again, just incredibly difficult to make these, but we'll have a go. See what we can do. Oh, just didn't have the legs. That gives us a nice, simple but power putt, which is what we really wanted. If you miss the green, that's all you can ask for. Got ourselves a good pass. We're still at four. Hole seven. It's a par four. Seven again. Got a bit of a bend in it, so I'm going to start out on the left to try and straighten the bend out. I mean, look at that. Can we go through those trees? I mean, that's the line, isn't it? It's over there, but I'm just going to roll out. Uh, what do I do here? See, if you're much shorter, it's easy. You play up here. I mean, that's a pop later there. That gives you a nice straight shot through the trees. We might try that. We might try that. I mean, I suspect we're going to go out to the left. Go, go, go. It's my gut feel. Oh, I clipped the tree. I should shorten it. Hit a tree as well. 
but rough. So not not as designed, but it's not awful. So we've still got 200 to go. I might lay this up to there. Because again, if you miss, you're so far down that hill. But then, oh, it's a par 4, you see. This is why it's a challenging course. Maybe let's play for here. This is why it's challenging. You know, if you miss, it's quite difficult. And you've got to kind of play good recovery, which I think we've got. So now we need to get this super close to give ourselves the par putt. So we've got 50 yards to go. Difficult green. Bit of wind. Hopefully we'll be able to get this close. Like well, the back spins, we should hold. Well, that gives us the par putt at least. Pressure shot. Although look at that, look at that slope. Relax. It's all good. Hopefully that's enough. Back door did him. So we got the par. I mean that's that's a difficult par four. That is a difficult par four. It's a shame you don't get stroke index or any stats on um on how you deal with those holes, but I bet you that's a tough hole. So big iron shot into the green for this par three. Again, controlling it's the issue, but you've got a bit of a backstop. I could watch this all day. We come up a bit short. No, no, it's just sort of trickled on. On the green. Well, not my best shot, but not terrible. So, breaks left late. Breaks right. So he breaks right late. And needs a good old whack as well. Let's see what we can do. Get in. In the back. Ah, uh, just uh, just le went at the end, but too much pace on it. Cool. Too much pace, really. And that was the problem with that. So I have another par. Very nice. But again, 250-yard par three. Tricky. So close out the first nine with this really long par five, 600 yards. Again, let's give it the absolute beans. Top spin with a lot. I could watch this all day. Got hold of it. Cleared that bunker with root to spare. All about the bounce. Might roll out here. Yeah, that's the problem. See, they're so narrow. So narrow. I thought the wind was going to get get more of it. So we're in the rough, which makes the control on this shot a little bit trickier. It's a five iron in. Not really much room for error because if you get down this side, you're off over here. So we'll aim here. Got to put a bit on for the impact. I don't mind being short as long as I'm not in the bunker, which I am. So, Give it a good whack. plug bunker shot. Super hard to judge the um, to judge the distance on these. We got hold of it. Yeah. But in the circumstances, that's pretty damn good. Could this be a birdie? So somehow I've got a birdie pup. We missed the fairway. We've been in a bunker, and we got a birdie pup. We would be fools to not take advantage. Nice so five under for the first half. Teeny cups are challenging. I think it's sixteen foot part though. So the inward nine to come. Let's see how we do. I'm with the Masters on TV. It's a Masters-like course. Uh, again, so this is a longish par four. And again, we've got a little route up here because of the length. Uh, I mean, you just can't get there. Well, you can, but I don't think I can get there and reasonably hold the fairway. So I might just try and play it up short to here. Try and stay on the fairway. And give myself a good second shot. Excellent. Nice shot. Nice shot. So the custom clubs aren't really helping me here. You can't use their full length, but there you go. That's why it's a challenging course. So 185 left. A long way uphill. That's only a six iron though, so a bit of wind. It's gonna need a bit of club. Ooh. 
We've got the ultra back spit, so if we can get it on, it'll hold. Just on the front. Might just take me back off. Nope, still on. Ah, uh, I wouldn't mind the chip actually. So, it's a late breaker. Sloping up. Breaks right. Let's try about there. See if we can get it close. See that? Oh, again. Foot too much pace. Just needed a touch less pace, and it would have it would have swallowed it up as it faded. That's a pump. So we're still at five. Par five to come. Hole eleven. It's a par five. Another one with a bit of a bend on it. So there's a little route through here. The problem being that when you land, you're going to straighten up. Now the wind should help me. Got a little bit of shape on it. Or is that going to land in the rough? Might just trickle back on the fairway. There we go. But you see, see how far it's over it shifts because of the slope. So if I had a pitched on there, I'd have been right you up the left hand edge. So that's not a bad shot. So again, not a lot of room to work with. We're quite close. We've got to make sure we pitch this on. And we want a bit of backspin on it. Let's make sure it's on. Didn't get the ultra backspin, but uh, it's okay. At least we clear the front of the green, so we're on. And I'll take that, middle of the green. Just a tricky pin position, so it's an eagle part. Even break. Breaks right. Again, can't hit it too hard, so maybe there. Oh, again, foot too much pace. Come on, get that birdie. But. Gives us the birdie pup. Bag your birdie. Easy. Birdie. Gets us to six. So 12's the par well. three. It's a par three. Uh, this is a tricky one, just because of the pin position. See where it is? So you, you've got this here. It rolls away to the right on you. So if I just sort of drop down, you can see it. it just everything gathers down on this side. So you've got to land here. The wind will help me out a touch. How close can I get it is the question. Nice shot. Nice shot. I'd rather be left than right. I'm not even going to be on, am I? Oh, just just rolled on. On the green. With a birdie now. Problem is, we're uphill. And just look at that. When it goes past, it's just going to race away down to that bottom. So let's just tap it. Tappy tap tap happy. No. No. But no problem. Close enough. Close enough. Gives us the par pop. Tricky green. Super tricky green. Nice par. Probably a little bit much of you slightly downhill. A hit up with the problem is you, you, there is no sort of straight downhill. It's always on a on a slope. So 13, par four. Hole 13. Again, this one's massively uphill, so we're gonna use the backspin trick again. See how far up we can get it. So it should give us a higher shot. Didn't hit the ultra backspin there. It gives you a higher trajectory, which should get you further up this. So 150 to go. Oh, look at that pin though, there's no room to work at all, is there? So a little bit of a cross tailwind. It's going to be a little bit short when it pitches, will it? No, slope's killed it. So, we've ended up short. Chipping opportunity. Oh, I just caught the, caught the front edge, but the pace was good. And we get a par up. But that second shot needed to be better. We needed to get on the green now. So still six under, and the par four. Hole fourteen. It's a par four. Oh, way downhill with this one. And again, you worry is you're going to roll out the green. So again, we're going to try the old um, slice technique. Oh, missed it. 
Genzo doesn't like it. Sometimes he's right, sometimes he's not. Yeah, it's going to straight and go out, isn't it? Yeah. Might even go out of bounds. No, bare ground. Oh, I was a bit worried there was an out of bounds marker there. So we've got a difficult shot here. I don't even know if I can get that up. Oh. Let's turn the approach off because we're going to need a bit of a bit of blood on it. Ha! Just try and get a bit of shape on it. It's on. It's on. Could this be a birdie? Okay, so I'm gonna break right. Well, Sloping up. Breaks right. There's not a lot of break on it. Get it. See that? Get in the hole. Bag birdie. Great birdie. Nice and easy. That gets us to seven. Par three to come. Hole fifteen. It's a par three. So again, tricky pin position. If you end up here, it'll just roll round to the left anyway. So the wind's going to help us out a bit. It's a long iron in, though. And we're into the wind, so we've got to make sure we get it on. Because if we're short, it's going to be a little bit wet. That's pretty much position A, and it should come round a little bit. Not quite as much as I'd like. Not quite the masters, but you can see it moves. Could this be a birdie? It's a 10 foot for a birdie. Look at that break. Goes down. Yeah. Breaks to the left. Cheers, Genzo. Get in. Oh. Again. I thought the pace was going to get away from me. Gets me to eight. Four, four, five to finish. Hole 16. It's a par four. So 16 looks uphill, but it's actually downhill overall. So again, we can give this one a good old beating. The wind should help us out a bit. Off you go. Good shot. Wow. Nice shot. No. Oh, just caught a bit of the tree. We shouldn't hurt it too much, but we should be pretty much centre of the fairway. On that central stripe. New record. To 87 to go. A bit of wind. A little bit downhill. A little bit in the face. Not the ultra backspin. So if it ends up on, it will grip. Okay. A lucky bounce as well. Oh, I don't know how it got there, but it got there. Bit of birdie now. Again, look at that break. Sloping up. Just died. Oh, died on me. I thought it was just going to miss. So we're at nine under. Three birdies in a row. Par four next on 17. Ball 17. It's a par four. So this is the one that you kind of got to swerve around the trees. So you kind of play this line here. But what I've been doing is this. So you go around those trees just so you're coming over the fairway not that rough so the first pitch there is on some fairway it seems to work all right although sooner or later i will hit a tree so 85 to go downwind again that green's just going to gather it all to the right so we'll try and drop it about there i think i've overhit that with the wind A little bit, but it'll come back. Looks like you made it. So it's a 11 foot putt, but if you miss, it's going down to that bunker. Goes down. So you've got to be super Breaks careful. Left. I almost want to leave this short. Right, it's going to run, it's going to run, it's going to run, it's going to run. Yeah. What? See what I mean? Ridiculous. Absolutely. I'm almost going to get this in. Just course, it's gonna go back in, isn't it? Oh. Ah! Oh. Don't ignore the gate. <laughs> oh. 
Oh, oh. Third time's a charm. Nice. And then you go past. And now I've got that same putt back. Break's not as bad, though. Goes down. Break's not anywhere near as bad this way. Oh. Look at that. I barely... T it has gone in the bunker again. Watch the gauge carefully. Give me a drop somewhere. Good approach. Well, there we go. Six over. So, destroyed the score, but that's teeny cups here. That's why this is a difficult course. Final challenge. Hole 18. Uh, just going to put it out of our minds. Last hole. What can we do? What can we do? We can probably drive it down here. Nice shot. Nice shot. Oh, you've got to just clear that out of your head. That's going to end up all right, I think. Yeah. Such tricky greens, though. You broke the record. Super Actually, put the power shot on. I could get my record drive there. So, again, not a lot of room to work. Give it a little bit more club. Oh, you need to stop. Stop. Hang Sketo. We're on the fringe. Oh, again, tricky. Super tricky. That's enough. Oh. oh, we get another go. It's so good we get another go at it. Yeah. Oh. Mm. I'll be finished with the chipping. Wow. There you go. So we got a shot back. Mm. So, if you take the six under out, I could have got ten under there, but you can't take the six under out because that's how this game works. Uh, so, good round. TD Cups is super challenging. Super challenging on this course. Let's have a look at it stats wise. Wasn't far off my record drive. Surprisingly, longest chip hit was pretty short. Made a 20 footer though. Hit some fairways. Missed the old green. I'm not unhappy. Well, thanks for joining me. I hope you like that. If you did, please like, please share, please subscribe. Um, subs are always good. Um, and I'll see you next time for a little bit more everybody's golf.